Carl Mostert, comic book artist from Cape Town, working with DC and various other independents, has worked on Batman titles as well as. And he's busy on a commission right now, but he's going to talk to us. Carl, how did you get to work with DC? Um, the story is to cut a long story short. Uh, one of the uh, talent cuts came to one of the Comic Cons in Joburg a couple of years ago. And I sent my work up from Cape Town. Um, and when he saw my work, he sent his business card back. I had to email him, and he said to me basically that they'd like to work with me and use me in their books. So I've become the Batman artist, well, one of the artists on the Batman um, books. Uh, of the past four years. Yeah. Um, how do you get time to come to Comic Con if you're so busy at DC? I, uh, <laughs> I don't actually have time. Funny story, I sent my normal reaction, wasn't uh, Batman uh, title 10 minutes before I jumped in the car and drove down to, or drove up to, whichever you're taking, is to Joburg. Um, so 10 minutes before we got in the car, I was sending off work and hoping for the best, hoping there were no changes. And uh, that was, I don't know why I'm here. I don't know how I have time, but thankfully I do. <laughs> it's for the fans, man. Tell us about your Batman work. Uh, woo, it's a lot of Batman work. I think the past year and a half I was working on uh, the Batman Urban Legends work. At, um, and that's what the Bat Dog, Ace the Bat Dog. Or oh, bad down, sorry, you can't say bad dog because he thinks he's saying bad dog. But uh, bad, Ace the Bat Hound and Batman in that series. I've also been working on a uh, I Am Batman title which is due to come out in November, and then other things after that. Um, been working on Deceased, which doesn't necessarily have Batman in it, but it has Batman uh, family in it. So, yeah, that's that's it. Are you a Batman fan? Of course. Who isn't a Batman fan? Even the people that say they're Superman fans first are Batman fans. You have to be a Batman fan. It's it's. If you're a comic fan, you are a Batman fan. <laughs> so, what what is your take on Batman killing Superman? Was that fake? Oh. Okay, that's a very contentious thing. <laughs> For me, uh, yeah, I don't think Batman would have been able to take Superman out. As much of a Batman fan as I am. I am also a Superman fan. Superman is way too powerful for Batman. But I suppose, I mean, you know, in the comics, uh, they shot him with a kryptonite arrow, they blew him up with an atomic bomb, and then Batman came in. So maybe, maybe there's a slim chance that it could have happened. <laughs> so there you have a Cole Master, not only a talented artist, but also an honest artist. Thank you, Cole. <laughs>